Hi, we're here to uh, do another round of interviews for Charlie Zelenoff. Uh, just ask him a series of questions about the upcoming bout that is exciting to uh, all of the internet public. So Charlie, tell us about how you feel about fighting with uh, your next opponent. Well, I mean, I'm looking forward to it. I mean, I'm looking forward to get my uh, first pro win and just go out there and just this time seriously fight my best, like fight my heart out and I promise I'll do it. Do you feel like you've trained hard enough this time? Uh, yeah, I'm training, but I, I plan to, to step it up. Like, every time I train harder, I try to train even harder. Alright, that's good. We've been seeing some of those videos you've been putting yeah. up. Look pretty good. So, let me know, what do you think about your opponent, opponent Hillbilly Pimp? I mean, I think... I mean, I, I think he's re he's like um, seems from what I've seen, his body's like he just doesn't have it. Like Master said, he he just doesn't have it in him anymore. And like I don't know if he ever did, but I just think he's too weak. I think I'll just be, be able to bully him around the ring and and you know eventually knock him out, like I promised. I mean, he's just too weak. He, I don't think he could take a he might be able to take a punch. But um, his stamina is horrible. I've seen him spar. I don't think he has a chance. What about his technique? How do you feel about that? I mean, it, as much as I dislike the guy, his technique is is kind of average, maybe below average. But it's not like it's not terrible. But he's just he he has no he has no power behind his punch. Okay, and you've analyzed the videos. Oh yeah, every day I watch his videos, and I already know exactly what I'm gonna do to him, how I'm gonna hit him. It's all set, man. That's good. So, talk about this bet a little bit. Uh, Five hundred dollar bet. Well, you know they say you got to take risks in life. Well, I mean I, I don't consider it that big of a risk because you know it just goes to show that how confident I am in my ability that I will knock him out in the first round. And I mean I've done it before in my exhibitions. I beat you know guys in the first round before, and three minutes for me to knock out Hillbilly Pimp. I think that's Plenty of time. I think that's too much time, actually. <laughs> All right. What about this promotion with the Rocky promotion style? What do you think I about think that's that? cool, man. I think that's really good, you know, for the people to come watch and, you know, show their interest and uh, put some money in the Internet pay-per-view and, you know, make it a big event. So the Internet pay-per-view's got you kind of psyched? Oh, yeah, definitely, man. It's <laughs> good. That's a good. That's Stacy is doing this, whatever he can to hype this thing up and, you know, make people come watch and, you know, enjoy a good show. All right, so give me just like a quick analysis of what's going to happen. I'm going to come out pressing the action this time. I'm going to come out, you know, nobody's going to be, you know, like last fight, I, it was my first fight. I believe I was too cautious this time. I'm just going to be there like like Mike Tyson, just go for the kill and just, you know, and just, just destroy him pretty much. All right, go for the kill. Yeah, that's good, man. That's right. That's how I'm coming in. There's no way I'm going to lose this fight. Well, y'all heard it. There's no way he's going to lose it. Yeah.